Hey, hey, everybody, Mountain Dew Mania here. Welcome back to Sky Factory 3. I have been grinding. Oh, my God. I tell you what. I am just about to the point where I hate Batania. Uh, I am not kidding. Every single pack I'm doing, I'm working on Batania. I hate Batania now. <laughs> All right, so my hydrant just gave out. Uh, so I had to make some more. Um, I will show you how to make those. What did I do with my... As you can see, I have been busy. Busy, 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 busy. But the thing is, you've seen me do all of this probably on another series. So I'm not going to um, take you through all of it. What I'm working on basically is making mana. I have got Endo Flames. Uh, that's an experiment I'm working on. I've got Endo Flames feeding the Mana Spreader, and this is the distributor uh, that I talked about. Uh, it's filling these three. This one right here has um, an Alchemy Catalyst under it. Uh, right here is a Runic Altar. This is how you make the ruins. And these hydrangeas are feeding. That mana spreader, which is feeding that. I also dumped in all my black lotuses. I had a stack and a few from mob drops, from loot bags. So I dropped all of those in. And I've been making living wood. I've been making living rock. And uh, I'm getting ready for the, the terrestrial algorithm plate thingamabobber, whatever it is. Um been getting more petals. I am getting ready to make the elf helm, the the elf um, portal or whatever you call it. But there's one thing that I haven't made on the other playthroughs that I wanted to. You see, I'm making ruins. Um, I'm pretty much. If you go watch Hoarder's Delight, uh, I'm probably about where I am there. I've made the mana. Um, Fire, air, water, earth, uh, spring, summer. I think I'm up to winter on both of them. If you've watched one, you've watched both of them. But there's one thing that I haven't made that I want to try. And Elder Sign showed it to me on their uh, his server. And we're kind of, they're streaming it and I'm just kind of goofing off. But you see that? If I put this grass in there, I get... A pasture seed okay now with a pasture seed if I put it in here I get a horn of the wild now check this out I think I remember how to do this let's see if I right click is that not friggin awesome how about that that is cool that is so cool Wow, it just kind of drums them right up. And I think you can also get this to like, uh, you can make one to shear, uh, I'm probably out of room, to shear leaves. I've added some more drawers um, and a drawer controller uh, just to, uh, <laughs> I get so much stuff. I'm just trying to be a little more efficient, get it done faster. Does this not have um, inventory tweaks? Let's see. There. Oh, so much stuff. So much stuff I have been working on. But I did want to show you that. I thought that was really cool. Um, and I, there's three of There's like drums and horns and all kind of stuff. And I haven't had time uh, to look at uh, the other ones. But I did want to show you that. That's something I haven't done in the other ones. But I thought it was really, really cool. All right, so what else have I been doing besides grieving for Fred? I know, poor Fred. Bless his heart. I murdered him. Well, I didn't murder him. Um, he just, it was a unfortunate circumstances. Uh, um, I didn't know if you put two roosters in together that they murdered each other. So that should have, that should teach me. But anyway, I did want to show you that. Um, now what I'm working on is I want to make some 
first I need to make some glimmering wood. I got a couple textures that aren't, but I want to make some glimmering living wood. So I just need uh, living wood and did I? Where's it at? There we go. Two, three. I think I just need three of these. Okay. So if I do that and one, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. Now I need an an elven core, elven gateway core. Okay. But see now I need terra steel. Ha ha. So how do you get terra steel? All right. Uh there's my hydrangeas. They're just uh, blue petals and seeing petals, and then a seed in the water, and you get that. All right, so let's make, let me look at Terra Steel. So in order to get Terra Steel, it takes a lot of mana, first of all, and then you have to have this terrestrial algromersion plate, ever this terrestrial aggy plate, and you have to make this right here. This is Living Rock and Blocks of Batania. Okay. And then once you get, let me show you this right here. I need Lapis, Block of Mana Steel. I think I'm out of Mana Steel again. Um, I've been getting some from Loot Bags, but not very much. So I'm going to have to make some. You just take Rune of War, and they have to be in this order. I have already messed up, and I couldn't figure out what I was doing wrong. I had Fire and Air messed up. So, anyway, that is what I want to work on now. So, do I have any? I probably don't have any um, thing over here. How many of these? Uh, do I have anything? Let's see. I need... Yeah, I need one mana, and I think I've only made one of those. I need a fire. No, not two. One. And then I need an earth and a water. Water. Okay, let's see. I want to make sure I get them in the right. So I need water and earth. Okay. So I need water and earth. I'm pretty sure that middle one is mana. That should be fire. And I need an air. Okay. That should be air right there. No, not two. Just one. Okay. So there is the air. Alright. And then I need... I don't think I have enough... I've got four. Ugh. I need, um, let me find some iron. I can make some, let's see. Two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, that should be enough. I, ne I never can remember if, let's see. All right, let me see. I'm always ahead of myself. Emma. There we go. Okay, so that goes in the middle, and then it was mana right there, water, earth, fire, air, and it's raining, and it's almost night time. All right, so let me sleep and uh, stop the rain and get some lapis, and then we will finish our uh, uh, Aggie plate. All right, so hold on. Okay, I'm back. As you can see, I've got so much. It's I got to I got to get some storage going. I have got to finish that colossal chest and get some stuff hooked up to it. But we will do that. And you can see, I'm just about done. I'm I'm done with the walls. I just have to get everything going. But I want to kind of do, um, dedicate one episode to that. Uh, so we'll just have to do that later. Right now, I'm in the Batania mode, and I do not want to. Uh, stop. So there we go. That should give us the terrestrial algomersion plate. Agglomersion. 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 
I'm not really sure how to say that. You know, mod makers, y'all need to do some stuff that we can pronounce. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, this goes right there. Now, in order to power that, and it's going to take a lot of mana, um, what I'm thinking about doing, and I've got somebody is kind of running an experiment for me. Um, I want to feed my ender endo flames with cold chickens and i don't know how many i would need you know what i'm saying i don't know like the range or how many you know so i want to try and just play around with that that's what that's up there for though i'm sure somebody has already done it but i have not watched any videos i want to see if i can do it myself so but in order to move this mana around, because I have got to power this thing, it takes about a half a mana pool to make one Terra Steel. And I need Terra Steel. So, um, let me see if I can remember. Uh, how do I make a spark? I can't remember. It's, it's gold. Um, oh, um, blaze powder petals and gold all right so one two one two there we go so there is now two put you in there uh two sparks okay so if i do that there there's one spark and there is another spark okay See, it's feeding that one. Okay, so when I get this full, I should be able to drop a mana pearl, mana steel, and a mana diamond on there, and I will get Terra Steel. Okay, so that is the plan. I tell you what, I am just about tired. <laughs> I am not kidding. I am just about tired of Batania. Every single pack I am doing has Batania in it. It is exhausting. Exhausting. But do I have... Um, no, I haven't made mana diamonds yet. So I wanted to go ahead and make a few of those. I will need them. Just drop the diamonds in. That's it. That's all you got to do. And so I will stick those in there for next time. So I'm going to wrap this up. I'm sorry this was just all about Batania. But I did want to get kind of caught up where I am on my other series so uh, I will probably make some more petals um, but next time uh, I will show you where I am what I'm doing with my chickens and we are going to hopefully not crash our game we are going to plug that bad boy up if it is too laggy I'm just letting you guys know if it's too laggy I will make a small one and I will I'll go into creative and get rid of this and make a small one because if I've got my notes right just a 4x4 four four diamond um, one of these holds 7200 stacks so it's not like I needed this but I wanted to build it so you know um what what can you do <laughs> but that's all i had time to show you um there is a ton more stuff i've done so i probably will just make i will get a few more things done and just go right back in and record another video um i have been working non-stop so i just wanted to concentrate on batania for this episode all right so anyway, this is Sky Factory 3. I'm trudging right along. I hate Batania. <laughs> and, good Lord. And I'm about, I hate chickens too. Except for Stud Muffin. He's awesome. All right, guys. So any hints, tips, I would appreciate it. If you have built the biggest diamond chest, let me know. Did you have problems? Did it lag you out? You guys know I have a potato uh, computer so it's probably just gonna blow the whole damn thing up <laughs> but uh anyway 
I hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you next time. For right now, I'm so out of here. Later, guys.